Good day everyone. My name is Raven. My name is Rulian. And, and this, this is Bad Ben. And, and welcome to Young Adapter. For today's lesson, you will learn how to solve percent problems involving percent of change, which are percent of increase and percent of decrease. But what is the percent of change? Percent of change tells you how much a quantity increases or decreases based from the original amount. There are two types of percent of changes. First, the amount increases, that is, percent of increase. The amount of decreases, that is, percent of decrease. So, so let's begin. Madali, 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 activity time! Pens up, papers up, module up. Get ready! Wonderful! Let's proceed to our first example. The price of a notebook increased from 10 pesos to 12 pesos. What is the percent of change of the notebook? That means we are looking for the percent of increase. To solve the percent of increase, we need to divide the amount of increase over the original amount. But how we are going to get the amount of increase? Do you have any idea? Wonderful! You are right! To get the amount of increase, we need to subtract the original amount to a new amount. This will give us a new formula which is percent of increase equals the new amount minus original amount over original amount. Now, let us substitute to a given the new amount or new price of a notebook is 12 minus 10 over 10. Let us solve. 12 minus 10 is equal to 2 over 10. So, let us divide 2 by 10. Since we know that 2 is smaller than 10, let us add point zero here. Let's put first the decimal point aligned from the decimal point into dividend. There you go. Let us divide. 20 divided by 10 is equal to point two. The answer is point two. But since we are looking for percent, we need to change the decimal point into percent. Let's move the decimal point two times to the right. One, two. Let's put zero to the empty place volume and don't forget to change the decimal point into percent sign now our final answer is 20 percent this means that the percent of change of the notebook is 20 percent wonderful great job now, proceed to another one. Let's try the second example. The price of a pen decreased from 10 pesos 
to 6 pesos. What is the percent of change of the pen? That means we are looking for the percent of decrease. To solve the percent of decrease, we need to divide the amount of decrease over the original amount. But how we are going to get the amount of decrease? Do you have an idea? Wonderful! You are right! To get the amount of decrease, we need to subtract the original amount to a new amount. This will give us a new formula which is percent of decrease equals to new amount minus original amount over original amount. Now, let us substitute the given. The new amount or new price of a pen is 10 minus 6 over 10. Let us solve. 10 minus 6 is equals to 4 over 10. So let us divide 4 by 10. Since we all know that 4 is a smaller than 10, let's add point zero here. Let's put first the decimal point aligned from the decimal point into dividend. There you go. Let's divide. 40 divided by 10 is equals to point four. The answer is point four. But since we are looking for the percent, we need to change the decimal point into percent. Let's move the decimal point two times to the right. One, two. Let's put zero to the empty placed value. And then, don't forget to change the decimal point into percent sign. Now, our the final answer is 40%. This means that the percent of change of the pen is 40%. Wonderful! Great job! That's it! Thank you for watching and listening. Hope you guys learned something new from us. If you want more easy activities to do at home, follow us at YouTube channel at Young Adapteram. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share!